Hi. All welcome to OIT speaking. What is the difference between has been diagnosed and was diagnosed? Has been diagnosed is used when the diagnosis would be news to the reader or when the condition has not yet been stabilized. Was diagnosed is used when reporting a past fact and the condition is now resolved or stabilized. Can we use comma after today or upon discharge? Yes. For example, upon discharge, comma, she was advised to have follow up home visits. Today, comma, Mr. X was admitted to hospital with complaints of can. I write the sentence like report S are enclosed. You can write the reports are enclosed. If this is mentioned as a task in the case notes, otherwise you should omit this details in the letter. Can we write? He smokes excessively and consumes alcohol in excess. With smoking and alcohol consumption, please be factual rather than adjectives. For example, he smokes X cigarettes and drinks Y units of alcohol per day. Can we use not? No. Apostrophe in letter. Yes. You can. For example, he has no interest in attending school. The father is not interested in discussing his son's problems in detail. When can I use recovering in the letter? Recovering is generally used after a procedure. For example, surgery. Because the patient still requires assistance or medication. Can I write refer back in the letter? We cannot introduce someone for a second time. So we cannot write refer back. In this situation, Updating the reader might be the reason for writing. For example, I am writing to update you about the current health status of Mr. X who requires further wound assessment and management of burns. Which tends to use to report events from today's visit. For details like test results or vital signs at the time of visit, the past tense is appropriate. For example, on examination, the abdomen was tender on palpation. On admission, her blood pressure was 160 bar 90 millimeters of Hg. Which tense is used for lifestyle choices? For details like lifestyle choices, the present tense is appropriate. Mr. X smokes 30 cigarettes per day. For details, which describes unresolved situations such as improvement or deterioration in patient's condition. The present perfect tense is appropriate. For example, since her last visit, Mr. X's pain levels have reduced from an A to a 4. Is it okay to use more than one tense within the paragraph of OET letter? It is fine to use more than one tense within the paragraph describe the visit. But always make sure you use the correct tense for the meaning you intend. Thank you.